his versatility is mind-boggling. I mean, I've seen him play things like Edward Scissorhands and, and, and what else? Um, uh, Charlie the Chocolate Factory, what is that? Yeah, and, and The Lone Ranger. And he played uh, uh, an English detective during the period of Jack the Ripper and uh, The Headless Horseman. And he'll, he'll, do, he'll, he'll take on anything. Most actors would run the other way rather than do some of the parts he did, you know? He's very courageous, and he doesn't seem to have any fear about committing himself. He's extraordinarily versatile. He's done so many good things. I just really, really, really like his work a lot. I admire him. Then I had the, uh, I had the privilege and, uh, of working with him early in his career. And uh, he's a good guy. You saw The Lone Ranger? I saw The Lone Ranger. I like this. I like this. One of those, one of those movies that you suspend all of your disbelief and you... Uh, you accept that it's a fantasy and it's a comedy, and you don't even, you're not even upset when people get killed in it. <laughs> it's one of, those, one of those movies that people can get killed, you're not really, you don't really get upset by it. It was a fun movie, and you see, the fact that he played Tonto in that movie, and that he just played the hell out of it, you know, he loved it. Loved doing it. He looked outrageous. He kept feeding this dead bird on <laughs> his dead bird on his head. Every time he would do that, I cracked up. I, I think he, I think he's I think he's a fine, fine actor. Well, thank you for watching. Now, if you've enjoyed these videos, tell a friend. And for more information about videos, my books, my classes, go to my website, www.ericmorris.com. And until next time, this is Eric Morris saying, no acting, please.